Okay, so it's me again. I apparently lied about my grocery haul being finished for the month because um, I guess it's only been a week since I went to Costco and did our big monthly grocery trip and I said, that's it, it's over. Well then what happened is that today Jason and I are going on a date and I thought, well, since we're going on a date, why don't I just stop in at Aldi's and pick up a couple pizzas for the kids. That would be fun. I don't really feel like cooking dinner for them before. You know, that would just be a fun treat. Well, I got there and I was hungry. I just didn't realize how hungry I was. And so before you knew it, I had $112 worth of food in the cart. And that's what happened. So I'm going to show you what I bought now, minus an apple, two tubes of yogurt, two string cheese, all of which I ate as soon as I got into the car. And more things have been rated since I got home. So let me show you what I bought for $112. And I have a big, ba big pile of boxes from our P.O. P o box. That's a tongue twister. So. I don't know. We're going to open those too. We're just, we're just going to go through it all right now. Okay. So I really, I had not even planned on buying this many pizzas. I, I just don't know what happened. I got carried away as soon as I got in there. So all of these pizzas were about $6 a piece. You know how Aldi is. They just change things up a lot from month to month. And I don't go there very often because I end up buying a lot. But for some reason, like the packages and things, typically empty out so much faster than Costco. I guess there's just less in things. And so I buy a lot, but then go through it fast. So it's not one of my regular shopping stops, but yeah, I plan to just get a couple of pizzas for the kids. I ended up bringing home this Supreme pizza, two of these bacon pizzas, and then two of the gluten-free cauliflower crust pizzas, which I have some bacon bits that I will throw on the top to add some meat to theirs. Um, of course, that's how they make everything about $6 because these are just plain cheese. You know, they don't have all the meat. Okay. Then I was craving yogurt, like I said, and I thought I have to have it immediately and I don't have a spoon in the car. So I bought Moo Tubes. Well, I couldn't just buy one because I knew I'd get home and have kids. So we have two boxes of these. And then I passed the string cheese and I said I had to have a string cheese. So I bought two string cheese packages yeah. Yeah, then I <laughs> then I grabbed um I saw this mozzarella it was laying on a shelf not where it belonged it was next to the pizzas but I thought you know I don't know if I have enough mozzarella and ketchup for this um stuffed meatloaf thing that I'm making for the freezer when baby comes I grabbed a pepper jack while I was walking past the cheese because Leo really gets a kick out of that I thought he might have fun with it so I grabbed one of those for the refrigerator even though I do have a lot of cheese in there right now that I had gotten from Costco, but not Pepper Jack. So the fruit, again, just looks so refreshing and delicious that I couldn't help but get more oranges, more apples, and more bananas. Although again, I did just buy all of this last week from Costco. That's okay. My kids go through fruit like crazy, so we will definitely eat it. Um, I have some pasta. That was the one thing that I had hoped to have my, um, I'd hope to stop by a restaurant depot or have my sister stop by when they get their order because I'm low on gluten-free pasta and that's the best place for it, the best price for it. This is kind of expensive. This is $3 a bag, so that's expensive, especially for Aldi prices, but I guess it's because they throw this quinoa in there. I went ahead and grabbed some yogurt. This I thought was a really good price. Um, it's organic and it was $2.69 for these and the kids, we had kind of a unexpected hot days where it's just suddenly gotten in the upper 70s, like 80 degrees one day. And the kids have been wanting those strawberry yogurt popsicles. So I just thought, why not? I'm going to buy some more of that. I grabbed a bag of this. I thought I was going to consume that too on the way home, but I didn't. There it is. So that will feed, you know, like two kids. That's what I'm saying about the size of these bags. This is cute. Isn't that cute? Look at the size of that. Very cute. Okay, I got a bunch of taco shells because we're going to have a family over on Sunday. And you know what? I have so much ground beef in the freezer. I think I'm going to do tacos. So those I bought. And then uh, these were on sale. And they are nice to have for different casseroles and things. And so I went ahead and bought those just because, um, you know, $1.24. $1.24. 
And then lastly, I'm trying to leave because I've already spent, you know, about $80 more than I planned to. And then they have these by the checkout. That's just not even fair. So I bought these. These were $2.29 and I'm going to go out and plant them and have gladiolus in July through September. We'll see. That's the plan anyway. Okay, so that's my accidental grocery haul. I wasn't even going to tell you about it, but I thought that wouldn't be right. It wouldn't be right to not tell you since I made all these promises about Costco last week. So there you have it. Let's open up this pile and see what's in it. Okay, my boys are helping me out, bringing me these big boxes that we got in our P.O. box. So I don't know. I have no idea what they are. You want to see in right here so you can look inside of it? Let's see here. This is a huge case of diapers. Does it say who this is from? Is there a paper down there? Yep. Here's uh, a big case of size one diapers. Oh, wipes. And some and wipes. Show the camera the wipes. This is from Laura Chambers in Ohio. Enjoy your gift. Thanks for all the fun videos, your amazing parents. Hope this little gift saves you time and energy. This is such a blessing. So I think I've talked about on my uh, videos that I'm really hoping with this yes, baby. Open that. I do okay, that. help him open it up. Jeez, that I'm really here. hoping to do part-time cloth diapering and then part-time disposable. It's been years, years, probably 10 years since I cloth diapered. And I'm hoping to get some cloth diapers to do during the day. But then for nighttime and traveling and stuff, I always do disposable even when I did cloth. I would do the both. So thank you so much because I did not have any size one diapers. So this is a huge blessing. And wipes too. Thank you. Should I get the tag out of this box? Yeah. If you guys can find me tags, that would be superb. James is heading away with a... I mean, there's a bunch. Oh, my goodness. Oh, read them all. Sometimes Mommy. Amazon is excessive. Mommy. I think they printed it over and over and over. They wanted me to get the point. Look at how many they put in here. That would probably save a dollar for them if they would. Okay, but here's the one. This says, congrats on the upcoming arrival of baby boy. I added some fun things for your older kids. All things that my kids, <laughs> look at this older kid. He's clapping over there. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, what, what? I sa it says, oh, you guys keep falling on me. Here, stand up. I added some fun things from your older kids, all things my kids have enjoyed, and some I know yours already do enjoy. Prayers for healthy delivery from Sherry Dak. Sherry is so precious. This is one of the moms in my group. I have the best group, I'm telling you. Okay, you guys need to come over here so they can see you. Come right over here. Silas, can you look at this, Jeremiah. Oh, no way. Oh, the craft loop refill. You know they'll use those. What is this? Tip over. We've never seen this one. It's a logic game. I think I saw it at somebody's house. Have you? That? Oh, you guys will really like that. Another airplane book. Hold on a second. Okay, James just knocked it down. Okay, you gotta stay, stand Ooh, right down here. Another airplane book. But it's oh. like cool. How these kids are obsessed with paper airplane, Sherry. This is incredible. Look at this, guys. Whoa. These are not plain white paper airplanes. And it shows you how to Oh, you it. take them out. You take them out and fold them. That's cool. Because usually they say you have to have this. And oh, this, and a shooter. And a launcher. Oh, how fun. Maybe we should put some of this stuff away for when baby comes. What? Or no, for when mom is so pregnant that I'm like, can't even move off the couch. Oh, We're getting yeah. there. Oh, Sherry, this is amazing. Mom, can I open this? Oh, he wants to oh, open tip geez. over already. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, let's see what else it is here. Yeah, that's fine. They saw that the rest is baby stuff, so they're heading over to open up their stuff. Oh, it's not though. Look at this. Elsie, are you in here? Oh, oh I had one book. of these she when knows. I was a girl. It is a flower press. One of the, book. if I can hold this right. Look, at what? <laughs> Bella just came in the window. Her mouth is open. Look at this. Um, I had one of these as a girl, Elsie. This is a flower press. Yeah. You are the flower lover. 
I was what? reading in my bed. Oh, okay. How sweet! Oh my word, what a package! It just keeps going. We have, yay! The pacifiers that I had hoped for. And these, Mom. Moms tell me these were a rubber were thing. band thing. That, and you let go and it that is cool. What else, Elsie? What? You guys! This is an LED lighted pocket microscope. That's something like I was showing you at Aldi. What's that? Why would we need it? No, a that was a power tool. I lighted it. <laughs> this is awesome. Why would you need mm -hmm. that? This is something that you it's can take out with you on hikes. So you can put a microscope in your what pocket. If you find something tiny, you can actually get it out and it How has cool. an LED light. That, that is Mom, so cool. I saw those I've got two the kids at the window now. Oh boy, this oh, is yeah. so exciting. Uh, shampoo shampoo and what? body wash. Mom, if you lose a rubber band, this is... Oh, nice. You are really excited about that. And this is, oh, this is the sheet for the bassinet. If you did not see, um, another lovely person bought us a, a little bassinet recently. You can, I'll link that video too so you can see it because it's really cool. It's perfect for a tiny house because it folds up. So this is a little sheet for that. Oh my word. There's something else. It's the baby face organic nose cheek balm. Can I open this This is from Sherry Dack, one of the moms in my group. What a precious package. Wow. Thank you so much. I am blown away. I'll have to call my grandma about this. Okay. My grandma, um, she's always like, did you get any packages from your people that watch your show? So I'll have to tell her. Now, did you find a, a card in this one? You're my card finder. Look for a card. All this excitement and I get to go on date night? I can't believe this. This is a day. I know. Okay, I thought I would include my favorite thing to use to stuff pocket diapers. Love them more than the microfiber from Kathy. No way, we were just talking about these. <gasps> Kathy, this is great, thank what? you. What? The cloth diapers and, oh, I'm gonna be so sad. What a blessing. And this is her favorite thing to stuff them with is unbleached organic pre-folded diapers, okay? I'm starting out on this adventure. We're gonna just yeah, see how this goes. Razor. I, I yeah. trust you, Kathy. Wow, what a day. Thank you so much, everyone. This is just a blessing. I've got kids trying stuff out everywhere. Hey, there's another envelope package right there. You guys, I thought I was done, but there's I'm not. Bring it over, let's see what that is. This just, it's like, hi, I know. This is, it's like we're swimming This is like we're having a baby. I'm hoping not to. Look, open this, one? this is like a baby shower. Open this one? What do you have? Yeah. No, I like that. Another person just came on the outside showing me a box that he has. I don't know where he got that from, but that looks... Oh, you just made it. Oh, we can put that along here for like library books and things. That looks great. Okay, more. There's more. I'll open it. Bye, time. Yeah, this is not one. Oh, this is part of that game. That's all part of a game. Put it all together. Right, it matches the bench. Okay, let's see, Elsie. This says, oh, enjoy your gift. Blessings for the new baby, Julian Jason, from Susan Baker. It's from Susan. Thank you, Susan. Let's see what this is. I don't know. Oh, I do know. Oh, we're just getting all the blessings in one day, Elsie. This is, this is, oh, you know how you said, did we wash cloth diapers with the other clothes and yet you were unsure about that? Do you want to be up here next to me? And I said, no, you wash them separately. Well, this is a wet bag to store oh, your you diapers the in until they're you put your ready. Diapers in. Thank you, Susan. I, I think I'm going to be totally set. I've got the disposable diapers for when I'm not cloth diapering, the cloth diapers, the inserts, the bag, this is all I need, right, cloth diaper people? It's been 10 years since I was on this adventure. Let's see, Susan gave us something else. What? Oh, how cute, cute, cute. I love them. All you have to do is put on these 
I was told these are just the most comfortable little baby shoes for little babies when they're first learning how to move around and stand up. Thank you. This is so much fun. There's one more thing here. What are you opening? Oh, you're looking at the game over there, Dean? This is, this is like, everybody sent this at the same time. Did they all get together like we're having a shower? Hi, Craig Keys. Enjoy your gift from Paula Mulqueen. Let's see what it is. Yay. Yay, yay. Baby socks that are actually going to stay on. You know, a lot, I had a lot of hand-me-downs from my other boys, but it's been three years, and when I pulled the socks out of storage, they were like, you know how socks get, the elastic doesn't want to hold, so this is very needed gift. Thank you so much. Woo! Okay, I think I'm ready to go on a date now. What do you guys what think? Are you excited? Yes! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> They like when we take yes. our date nights we because they get shows. movie night and, out. you know, something fun to eat. So. You're unpacking the game. Good job. So it'll be fun. Thank you, everyone. And we will be back soon with an all-new video. Bye-bye.